last time you guys saw me snowboarding, I was at the top of the Colorado mountains. I wanted to learn how to snowboard because I had absolutely never done any winter sport in my entire life. Honestly, any sport for that matter. I made it my very life mission that I learned at least how to stand up on a snowboard. I was defeated. But today we are taking it back and we are going to the Washington mountains. And we will be going to every ski resort around Leavenworth and tackle the Washington mountains. The mountains were crazy. There was so much powder. You couldn't turn your board. It was snowboarding for the pros, except we aren't pros. So this is everything that happened. Let's go to Washington. Hey, thank you. Oh my gosh, Seattle rain. All right, we officially made it. Now let's go pick up our bags and head to rental car. I really, really knew that I was gonna be back, but I just didn't know how soon I was gonna be back. I'm excited. the best car we've ever gotten on the rental. I think so too. Let's go. Ooh, it's cozy in here. It's like a big old box. It's like me living my G-Wagon dream without a G-Wagon. This is great. There's just something about Washington. I can't explain it. It's just such one of a kind place. I had Jacob pull over because I had to see this. The trees, the air. I belong here. We're hungry, so we had to get a little bit of a midway snack. Now we still have a two hour drive up to Leavenworth. So let's get started. <laughs> These are the little boots. Dude, these literally look like you're about to walk on the moon. Yeah. Ow. Okay. Here's here. <laughs> nice. I'm putting some gas in the four by four, 3000. I'm gonna go inside. I wanna get some snacks because it's like an hour drive to the ski hill. Not that I'm driving, but I'm just saying. What are we getting? Every time I went to the gas station, I need to get a bag of chips and a drink. <laughs> gonna go hit the slopes now. We're doing a night session, which should be super, super fun. I'm really excited, but I'm very nervous. Cause I feel like I already forgot everything I even <laughs> ever learned. Okay. Oh my gosh, it is so cold. Guys, it's so, so snowed here. Look at everything is white and there's like freaking 10 feet of snow. Like actually it's freaking crazy. cold and it literally <laughs> it takes forever to get dressed shout out to Hollister for keeping me warm as well if Hollister was a woman I'd marry I'm just kidding I'd be friends with you too far damn you look like a baddie I look like a fucking baddie that's what I look like <laughs> oh my gosh my head bro I could barely keep my head that's how heavy all this is <laughs> like if I just let, relax it a bit <laughs> the baby hill and it's right here behind us and then the lift for that it's right there it's past this is the hill where you go to where you don't know what you're doing are you ready yeah i'm ready jake i forgot how to do this i'm not gonna lie man that's a noob again bro i'm so nervous oh this is our first time getting on a lift in like weeks i'm scared jake are you scared no actually yeah, i haven't fell in a minute <laughs> okay good oh one God. Nat. Oh it. my gosh. Dude, our ski lift just took a shit on us. What happened? Way capacity over. Yeah, cause when you got on. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go down. <laughs> start. 
for sure a rough start. But this is so hard. Like, I literally want to quit already. I just saw this. Oh my gosh, I'm staying up. Wait, this is progress. Two seconds later. If I didn't have this helmet, I think I'd be dead right now. I just broke my nail. I'm done. I want to cry. I'm done. Retired. It started snowing and I'm literally stuck outside because Jacob dropped his phone in a porta potty. I'm just waiting for him to come pick me up. I'm out. It's literally snowing on me. Excuse me? Excuse me, can you help me real fast? I dropped my phone in the toilet. I just need a light. Dude. <laughs> That's the most <laughs> random side quest I've ever recruited for. That's a fucking banana. <laughs> Why is there a banana in here? Dude, this is nasty as fuck. <laughs> Show us what you got. All right, we got some gloves. I got into a shitty situation, literally. Oh my I gosh. dropped my phone into the porta potty, the actual toilet water. I picked up something and it was a banana. A banana. Jake's like literally a character. You never get bored with this man. He's always up to something. Any dookie stains anywhere? <laughs> Why did you smell it? No dookie stains. Anyway, snowboarding was a solid six out of 10 today. Day one, kicked my ass. Look at how cute, I love this place. We are officially now in Leavensworth. Didn't really get to see it because we got here at night. So tomorrow I definitely want to see more of it. I was humble today. We have a super long day again tomorrow. So we need to be nice and ready, nice and prepped because we don't know what ass kicking we're gonna get tomorrow. <sighs> Nobody talk to me. Good night now. I'm playing SZA on my laptop so I can wake up. I put on my under layers. Literally, I bought this shirt at Lulu. I bought like three different variations of this shirt. I bought it and like, I just didn't really think, I didn't know what I was gonna use it for. I just bought it because I was like, ooh, this is gonna come in handy one day. Well, it turns out it's actually like a really good under layer. Underneath, it warms you up so fast. Can you tell he's my boyfriend, babe? Do you hear that shit all day long? This is like all I play, usually in the mornings, right? Is that my morning, fam? Yes. <sighs> okay, I have world's dry skin like in the world. In this weather, my skin is cracking. So I put two layers of moisturizer and we're just gonna pray for the best. All right, it's time to gear up. Black North Face pants. Everyone out here doesn't wear North Face. Like they wear like real skier brands. We are heading out. This RV is super cute, by the way. It's like on top of a garage. This is Leavenworth. This is freaking crazy. Look at these houses. I always thought Leavenworth was like a little town, but no. Look at these houses. Are you kidding me? That's like something you see in LA. Look at this one. Anyway, let's go get some coffee. We need to warm up. We're gonna go to Argonaut. Argonaut. It's a pretty famous coffee shop out here. We brought the food because they don't have indoor seating. Their hot chocolate, literally 10 out of 10. It's so good. The coffee, I think they might have done my order wrong. I was supposed to get an horchata latte, but it tastes like a ginger turmeric type of latte. This is their breakfast biscuits. This is good. We just stopped here in Wenatchee, which is like another little city here in Washington. We pit stopped here because we're trying to get to a ski shop to get more jackets because it's really, really, really cold out here. Like really cold. Guys, there's so much gear. This one's super cute. I think I'm gonna go with it. Oh wait, they don't have my size. Bruh, I really liked that one. Wait, this one's really cute too. Wait, I might do this one. They don't have my size. Nice, we got our stuff. So now we don't have to freeze. Let's finally head up there. It is literally 10 a.m. already. We're gonna be like so late. It's snowy. 
If we're I... in the middle of a storm right now. I'm getting just a tad bit nervous. We just got here to the ski resort. There's not a lot of people here, and I think because of the storm. I'll show you guys the new jacket that I bought because it's so cute. The new gloves that I bought, I can use my phone with the under layer. And then the outer layer is like mittens. Oh, OTD. Let's boot up. I'm ready. We got our board, y'all. Let's go, shall we? Oh man, the storm is only getting worse. It's truly only getting colder out here. I'm already tired. Hi, I bought my tickets online. Do I get the card here? Uh, yes. Ready? That's it. Thank, Thank you. you. Oh, we are so dead. No, we're not. You got it. You got it. I don't know where we're gonna go. There's two trails. I think we're gonna go straight behind us, as you guys could tell. Ugh. It looks open. All right, let's go. <laughs> We've been here for five minutes. I don't know what she's planning on doing. Hi, Nat. Started with run two. Okay. I'm already tired. Don't fall now. As long as you don't fall, you're good. Oh my god! This is insane. I never thought I'd be able to do this. Shit, how am I doing this? Oh my gosh, Jake! I'm doing it. <laughs> getting some lunch. I feel like everywhere we go, we have to find a fuzz spot. Nothing like a bowl of pho after a long day of snowboarding. Mm, that broth is good. Let's try the noodles. Fuck. Guys, the houses that we showed you in the morning, do you remember them? And it was all like green and clear? White Christmas, okay? Look at them. They're full, like you can't even see their yard anymore. Guys, the roads are literally, they're just like white. <laughs> Foot of snow I'm getting dressed because I really want to go to the little roller coasters that we like ran into yesterday. Jake is asleep on the bed because he's really tired. I feel really bad because he's been driving. So we're gonna let him sleep and we're just gonna go solo. <laughs> Got the car key right here. The Jeep won't fail me. I know it won't. Let's go. I'm really scared. There's just more snow than I imagined that there was gonna be. You could do it, Nat. I'm a bad bitch. I could totally do this. <sighs> I'm a little scared. There's nobody else on the road. It's literally just me. I just want to see a car pass by. Like I'm gonna be more comfortable if I see somebody else doing it. Mm -hmm. 
I'm literally, I'm, I'm slipping. I literally haven't even gotten out of the driveway and I'm fucking slipping. I'm a bad bitch. But the thing is that if I start slipping and somebody slams into me, I'm not a bad bitch then. <gasps> Jake! Hi, Jake! Hi! Get out, bro. <laughs> Move. You saw me? I was doing so good. Go, get over. Go. Thank you so much. I'm quite concerned because we're the only people in the parking lot. <laughs> Yesterday it was packed. There's nobody here. Not even any workers. Let's just go find out if it's open. It might be open. I have high hopes, you know? We ain't scared of no snow. Snow scared of us. Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. Due to extreme conditions, they're closing at 4 30. <laughs> It'd be fine, but Jake's gonna laugh in my face and I'm gonna be so upset. Shut up, don't tell me anything. Anyway, we came to the downtown area. This is where all the pretty lights are at and there's a lot of people out. Look, there's so many lights and there's people that are sledding. What the fuck? That's Jake. Where'd you get that? Oh my God. <gasps> nice. Let's go. All right, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> that was so fun. You wanna go? All right, Jake's gonna give it a go. He thinks it's gonna go. Jake, it's not. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm gonna lose my mind if that sign says closed right there. Yeah. It does. I was trying to go to the chocolate factory, but what the hell? I don't know what happened, but like every. Oh no, I do. There's a storm. But like everything's closed. Hi. just checked out of our Airbnb and we are heading out to a different city. We stopped for coffee at this super, super cute little like hut place. I love it. And actually the girl there ended up knowing us, which was even better. But we are heading out to our third ski resort today. We are going to the summit, which is about an hour and a half away from here. That highway was actually closed this morning. So I hope that it's not closed right now because that's literally the only way to get there. There is a blizzard. It knocked me out of my sleep and I wake up to this. Look, the car is literally being thrown side to side because it's so windy. Oh my gosh, look guys, the trucks are putting the chains on. We're not that, that far from the snowboarding place, but I don't even know if we're gonna be able to snowboard because this is getting really bad. And the longer we stay, I think the worse it is. Guys, we just got out of the car. We have all of our gear in our hands. Oh my gosh, the wind is so bad. But we're gonna try and see if we can even get up. It's so windy, the blizzard is literally not playing. Bro, it's so packed here today. Looking for the easy one? Yeah. This is the easy one. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Oh my. Dude, how do people fit in this? It's nice, but I will never get on here with you again. You know what? It's too small, babe. Fine. If we fall, <laughs> he jumps. <laughs> It's 3.50. The blizzard is so bad that I hope they didn't shut down the roads for us. But we're heading to back down to Seattle. Drink up! Stop! Oh! This guy's a troll. We stopped to get some food and water because honestly, I don't know if we're gonna make it out of this. And uh, I don't wanna be prepared. Airbnb number two. Let's 
unwind because it was literally like a total of maybe like four hours of driving. I didn't even drive it. I'm exhausted, so I feel so bad for Jake. I just woke up. And tell me why I have an email from Alaska Airlines saying that my flight was canceled. We were supposed to leave today at one. Babe, we don't got no fucking flight, so we're gonna wake up because today I really wanna go explore Seattle again. I wanna go hit all of the spots that I didn't hit last time that I came. Revisit all the spots that we loved last time. It's so cold. Okay, exploring Seattle OOTD. We are back in Seattle. I want to hit one of my favorite coffee shops that when I came out here, I literally fell in love with it. It's called Anchorhead Coffee. And I really liked their coffee last time that it came. And that's literally like the, I've been craving that coffee so bad. <gasps> we have returned, guys. This is Anchorhead right here. Oh my gosh, this place is beautiful. Cozy clothes. Dude, they're gonna love this. I'm gonna take this one for Ellie and then this one for Pia. Can I get a red velvet cake, please? This was literally the best cupcake shop here in Seattle. It's called Cupcake Royale. It's so delicious. Alright, now we're stopping by for coffee number two here at Seattle Coffee Works. Can I do a latte, please? We can do a half caramel, half what mocha. now the streets of downtown Seattle. This is like where the mall is at. We're gonna do a little bit of shopping. We don't have much space in our check luggage, so probably not too much shopping. Nah, not too much. We are at Nordstrom. I love Nordstrom. It literally has everything that you could ever want and more. Guys, this is so beautiful. I love it. My toxic trait is thinking that I need to buy something nice every single time I go on a trip. Come here. Jake, come here. Jacob. If you go shopping with your boyfriend, does he act like a brat like mine? Because I'm literally just trying to enjoy my time, you know, scrolling through the skim section. And this man's bitching and nagging about he wants, he wants to leave. Like, bro, just wait, you know? I'm almost done. I don't want you bitching and nagging, all right? You got five minutes. Oh my God. Next place we're coming to. Oh my god, do you guys hear the water? The iconic REI. Seattle has the most beautiful REI. This is literally the outside of REI. Can you believe this is a store? <sighs> oh my gosh, Jake, I'm so nostalgic. Aw, this is so cool, I remember. Aha, my favorite section. High visibility jacket. You don't like to wear them in the woods and then you use them? This will fit Ellie a little snug, huh? Ellie, Ellie has a big belly. Ellie's fat. Oh, I said big belly, not fat. Ellie got her, her mom's belly. Her mom's belly's gone. What are you talking about? <laughs> All right, Edith's birthday is on Saturday, and I just found the perfect gift for her. <laughs> if you know Edith, you know she drinks so much water, like so much. We're coming to this new cafe right here. Oh, we got out of the car because someone's walking by. Guys, there's something. Do you guys spot it? but like the flavor is really good. Literally like 9.5 out of 10. We got our drinks, so let's head out. We're going to the airport. Bye Jeep, you were good to us. 